Welcome to You Volunteer. My name's Anna. And I'm Robin. And uh, today for the collab week, we're, we've decided to do a psychopath test. Now, we're both psychology majors, so we figured it would be a fun thing to do, figure out if, you know, we're in psychology for the right reasons or the <laughs> wrong reasons. I'm going to link the test down below if you want to see if you're a psychopath. And then we can all have a conversation as the psychopaths we are or aren't. All right, let's get started. So we're going to begin the test. Uh, we've decided to take two approaches to the psychopath test um, in which one of us is trying to be a psychopath, which is going to be Robin, <laughs> and I'm going to attempt to answer the questions like a quote-unquote normal person. You rarely catch me making any plans. I'm far too spontaneous. See, if I were a psychopath and a little bit crazy, I think I'd not make plans for anything. I'd have no problem cheating in on my partner if I knew I could get away with it. Um, I'm gonna have to go with no. <laughs> a psychopath says yes. If they would even have a partner. Well, Maybe they, they're two psychopaths and they've fallen in love ooh. somehow. <laughs> they're just both using Tomorrow each other. Tomorrow night on BBC. <laughs> if I get a better offer, I wouldn't mind canceling long-standing plans. I mean, it depends on the plans and it depends on the offer. <laughs> I don't get bothered by seeing animals injured or in pain. I think I would. I, I definitely, I can honestly say I get bothered by that. <laughs> and it's the number one quality of a psychopath being they start injuring animals. I guess I have to agree with that one. That's the psychopath I am. <laughs> it would be fun to drive fast cars, ride roller coasters, and go skydiving. Um, I don't really see how this is a, the definition of a psychopath. Yeah, like, <laughs> like, would a psychopath rather be doing, you know, other things to help their plans along? Yeah. I'm yeah. gonna go with slightly disagree because they don't have time for that. Ain't no psychopath got time for that. <laughs> I think it's okay to step over other people to achieve my own ambitions. <laughs> I'm very persuasive and getting people to do what I want is a real talent of mine. Um, I'm gonna go with disagree <laughs> and totally agree because that's like one of the big things about a psychopath <laughs> my ability to make quick decisions means I would suit a dangerous job if by dangerous job you mean a therapist <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, that, that can be true you know you well, get like okay. a kid being like oh, I'm, gonna I'm, run a psychopath. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you <laughs> when the people around me are crumbling under the pressure I'm usually the one with a cool head. Well, my hair is purple, so clearly I already have a cool head. But... <laughs> <laughs> Had to throw that in. If someone gets conned, not coned, <laughs> who cares? They're asking for it. Um, I mean, it, again, depends. But, <laughs> but I'm gonna go with slightly disagree. I'm gonna go with totally agree. <laughs> I'm rarely to blame for things going wrong. It's usually the fault of the people around me. Absolutely, completely agree. <laughs> <laughs> it's more like narcissism than yeah. psychopathic. Psychopathicism? All right, so we've reached the end of the test. Uh, we need to state our gender, age, occupation, income, education, favorite news source, favorite animal, and favorite music. I am a 70-year-old woman <laughs> who uh, is in <laughs> agriculture. Okay. Makes no money. Okay. Is in primary school. <laughs> um, clearly, clearly you're a psychopath. <laughs> <laughs> the Daily Telegraph. That makes sense. An old woman reading the Daily Telegraph. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Her favorite animal is a hamster. Okay. Um, and she likes rap. Alright, so I'm going to be a 19-year-old female. I love puppies and dance music. Or puppies who dance to dance music. <laughs> 27%. 94%! <laughs> I am warm and empathetic with a heightened awareness of social responsibility and a strong sense of conscience. Mine makes being a psychopath sound cool. It's like, oh, you can play hardball with the best of them. You know what you want, and you're not afraid to go for it. Well, at least we know this test kind of works, but you can cheat at it, so. Yeah, clearly. <laughs> um, well, thank you for watching. Uh, we'll see you guys next time on You Volunteer, and uh, we hope you have a great day.